Hey everybody, Ezar here again, uh, just continuing my playthrough for the Valkyrie run. Hopefully I'm a little bit better this time around, I've been having some trouble so far, so let's find out how I done do with this stage. Got it. Now this guy I think I can... No, I gotta get more. Don't do it! He's a jerk. Jesus. He really wants me dead. Showed him, though. Whoop. Ah. snake. Alright, now we got the Mario parts. Ah. Gotcha. Look at that. I caught him and I freaking made him fly. Don't do it. I asked you not to do it. You guys saw it, it was self-defense. That was almost very bad. Like, not even kinda bad, like very, very bad. Don't, thank you. All right, now we're going this way. Oh. That just split into two. There must have been two there already, because that was really weird. Ah. We're gonna go with this. Oh. That. Alright. Alright, now we're making progress. Now we're cooking with fire. I didn't mean. Okay, sweet. I was say I'm gonna I'm gonna fall into that fire now that I said fire. That, that was just poetic justice, as they say. Ah! Got him. All right, doing way better this time. Cause look, this is the ending. Once I kill this giant snake. Ah, oh, sweet. I know that, like, I think the record is 17 minutes or so for someone beating it without dying. That's what I've seen anyway. Uh... I got Mjolnir. Lost me all there. I don't know if the game's done quick as like has featured this game at all or not. So. Uh, oh oh oh! I don't know how I didn't lose that right there. Usually. It's like a mini explosion, and oh sweet, now I can jump. Oh no! Son of a bitch, as they say. Oh my god, that was bad. I was doing so good. Oh well, let's get good again. Mjolnir! I know, right? Rip. Don't you stupid snake. Helmet! Got a helmet. Jump. Oh, what the hell? I always go through that thing, and there it did. Cool. All right. Well, this is good. This is good. Big fan. Ah, but, uh. Seriously, why would you get, make this giant snake creature? Why would you give him a shield? Why would you do that? That's just mean.
<laughs> Snake dude does have some abs, you are correct. <laughs> obviously they have the Spartan workout, because uh, this is obviously the Spartan, you know, underworld. Alright. We're gonna do this. I'm gonna do it very slowly, I guess. There we go. That's how it usually goes. You just get right in there. Alright, now I gotta jump. Duck. I have to wait right here for that big jump. There it is. Oop. Victory. Victory! Like, I know what I'm doing. Like, I've done this before. Good. All right, and now we're starting the boss, Fluffy, as he's known. Big old Fluffy. Actually, I was wondering. Okay, you're gonna bite me here real quick. Can I actually jump at you? No, I can't. Okay, so you jump way the heck back there. So I, I literally can only hit you when you jump at me. Alright. Double throw and missed it twice. Double throw. Worry about right here ish. That's what I want to do. Throw and. Oh, screw you. I had you with that throw. Oh, I saw it in the was like, why the heck didn't I get hit there? Oh well. Woo! 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 Alright. Next is World 5, my least favorite. Actually, I don't think this one's all that bad. But, then again, last one wasn't all that bad, so I'm probably gonna get... Just wrecked by this thing. I think Mjolnir's right here, actually. Yeah! Start off with Mjolnir. That's not good. Hey! There we go. Alright. Nope. Oh, uh, well, at least I got the guy. That's the important thing, right? Right. These sons of bitches. Oh, hey, red dude. You're the worst dude in this entire stage. I got die bomb me. Yep. Oh, I miss you twice. That's cool. Get the crown, oop, and can't block that. Wasn't wrong. These guys are really annoying because they'll dodge if you chuck the spears like at their heads, and I hate that. Oh my god, that took me forever to finally like just know not to do. For example, who dodge? Jerk. That's what you get. That's what you get for dodging the spear. You get my sword. That's the whole point of the game, but I don't want to. See those birds? They were all primed to attack. They were all like, oh, we got this. Which I think I already screwed up. Yep. I think I have to jump over that entirely. Like that. Ugh. Ah, ah, I did not remember him being there. Okay, that was good luck I stopped, I guess. <clears throat> uh, ah, Shabotsky. 
Got oh crap, that's right, delete or else I die. And throw, and throw. Can't jump over that because I'll die. I don't like dying. You. I don't know what you are, but I hate you. Thorough contempt to be had. Uh, I'm gonna wait for it to stop, then jump. There you go. Jump. Okay, let's not carry me all the way over there. That was cool. And. No. Oh, okay. That was weird. Oh, what the... Oh, wait, no. That was cool. That was, that was just... That was nice. These nice things have been said. I appreciate them. Jerks. Can I just jump on there? Cause I, no, because I really just want to jump on there is what I want to do. Nope, okay. Like right here? Nope. A bit higher. Right there. There we go. Yeah. Now we got one of the boomerang guys. Yep. This is like the worst area in this entire game if you don't have the metal shield right here. Don't. Don't. Thank you. Crap, where's Mjolnir in this stage? I know I know where it is, but I'm not remembering at the moment. Hmm. I don't think I passed it. Maybe I did. Crap, that would suck. Whoops. Oh no! Old Red. Arch Neremnesis Red. Dive bomb me. I'm gonna duck and block. Yep. Oh, I'm only gonna hit you once though. Now you're gonna ground pound us ground. As I said, now you can charge. Oh, I can't duck under that. What? What? Get Rex, as they say. That was that was BS. Oh, and I don't even block it. Really, really, you stupid bird. Again. Yeah. Now what are you gonna do? You gonna you gonna die bomb me? Do it. I asked you. I told you. Yeah. Whoa! Whoa! What? When did you die bomb? When did you? Whoa! When did that happen? Never have I seen you do that twice. You always do it once to take off. That was not cool. Not cool, dude. Oh crap. Oof. Oof. I didn't think I was making that, but I did, so thank goodness. Uh, I don't even want to deal with you. I really don't. Up here? No, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, there's Mel there. That's right. Okay, there it is. I remembered after I said something. No! There we go. Ah! God damn it. That's me for being getting impatient. Nope, I can't actually duck below that. Oh well. They have become sentient. Skynet. Skynet alert. Alright, there's that waste tone. This guy's just gonna take forever now that I don't have anything to actually do damage to him. take longer. Not my fault. I ain't gonna get hit by you again. Can I at least get up there? Oh, I can't. Okay, let's try this again. Ready? Oh, look at me go. I'm flying, man. I'm flying. Oh, crap. 
game. Gotta play the player, because the player's bad. I know I need that. That fire sword would have helped so much right there, because when he's sitting there doing his little <clears throat> whatever destructo disc move, you can actually just sit there and pound on him, and I think I've been able to kill him in like one combo, because he just takes he's up there for so freaking long. Dang it. Stop it. Alright. Can I jump from here? Nope. Jump from here. There we go. Like, you just run into it like you don't even care with that freaking thing. Oh, uh, no, he's the actual boss. said he's actually not that bad it's just the fact that I didn't do I rushed it that's pretty much all he does is he just keeps he'll charge you and then he'll do the dive bombs and he'll make like, the shock waves or whatever and then from there it's just um, the little uh, whatever the hell I call him, Destructo Discs. And once he starts doing those, like I said, he's pretty much just sits there the entire time. And you I just keep missing. Yeah, screw you, red guy. <clears throat> it's not a big sports guy. Never have been. <clears throat> yeah. No, I'd say definitely uh, check it out if it looks pretty good. It, you're pretty much seeing all you do is you just keep dying. It's very much a difficulty uh, memory kind of memory muscle memory. That's what I was looking for. Kind of game, but uh, it's a lot of fun, and it's the controls are really really good. Where when you die, it's always because of you. It's never like, oh, stupid game. I mean, yeah, it's frustrating, but... Oh! Oh, boy. That's not good. Okay. That, seriously? Stupid. That was all me, I know, but still. Could have been the game. No. Actually, you got me really interested to see what the speed run would be for this game. Oof. Probably to check that out when I uh, get done streaming this. Uh, I'm not going to make it. Come on! Oh yeah, I remember the first Dirk nu Duke Nukem Scroller games. Those were, those were a lot of fun. I loved those games. Much better with the fire sword. Like I said, you can just sit up here. He's super easy as long as you got the fire sword, but. 
There you go. World 5 done. Six lives. Cool. I don't think I ever... I don't know, I've thought about it. I say I never die on the sixth world, but... And here we go. Ah, stupid bird. No, it's over here. There we go. Uh, only story for this is uh, literally Odin brings you back to life because you're an amazing fighter, and uh, that's it. You just it's go this direction, kill everything in your way. So uh, the endings actually tell you like the most of the story, but there's really not much of a story. Like I think it's. You're brought back to help save, uh, to, to prevent the, basically the end boss from being the end boss, or like getting more power or something like that. So, oh, they kind of made the game specifically to be like, hey, we don't want a story, we don't want anything special. There's no princess. It's just you're going. You're just being as badass as you possibly can. Ah, and I missed. I think it's just, uh, hey, Odin was, uh, proud of you, or, like, you know, for being so awesome, so you just go out, and, uh, you kill everything. Oh, boy. No, there's right there. The ending's actually pretty funny, because I think, like, when you're, when you first do it... Oh, okay. Oh, that was, that was, that was about to be very bad. Um, it actually like does it the first ending or whatever. Oh crap! From uh, the point of view of the ba of the bad guy, he's all like, "Hey, I was just sitting here minding my own business, running some experience, and this Viking jerk came out of nowhere and killed me." I thought that was pretty good. You stupid bird! This bird, man, I tell you. My biggest thing for this playthrough is uh, there's technically two parts to every single um, level. There's part the Crystal Path, which is just like the normal one you can use, and then there's this one, which is the Valkyrie Path, which is as soon as I die, I use one of those Valkyrie Souls, which is in the upper right, and in order to collect more, like this little guy, so now I have nine, and in order to collect more, you have to keep getting treasure chests. For every treasure chest you get past uh, a certain point, 
once you have all your equipment and stuff, you get more Valkyrie souls, so... It's basically like, in order to get the true ending, you need to be as, uh... Oh! Uh, okay. Uh, as... You just basically need to keep playing the game. It's all muscle. It's all muscle memory. Knowing how the how they do it. Think like old school Mega Man. Only instead of absorbing the boss's powers, it's just you being the Viking. Because, well, it's all you need to be. Yeah, we'll do that. I'm gonna regret not getting that chest. Just watch. This is hands down my favorite part, though. Um, right here. This is the final boss of the crystal playthrough. And for doing this particular thing, you just jump through the glass and you instantly kill him. So you don't have to fight him at all. I love that. That's the dumbest thing in the world. I don't know why I think that's just the coolest thing, but oh, I love it. Alright, so then, like I said, uh, this is the secret. Valkyrie ending, so you have to get all the waystones by doing all the stuff up top. So now I do the portal. And this this area has just saying it made me its bitch uh, is kind of an understatement. Like I still I still like even with ten lives I'm like okay I hope I can get through it but I don't know if I can. This is just not going to be a fun part area. Ah oh, dang it. Whatever. Here's problem area number one. That's not good. Don't even be like that. Okay, well. Thanks, Mjolnir. Appreciate you. Here, in order to unlock you, I gotta spear you, kill, and go. It's not gonna bother with you. Jump. Alright, here comes the really annoying part. I have to kill you. You son of a bitch. No! Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go for it. It's probably gonna end up not working out in my favor, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Don't. Nope, that's not gonna end well. Okay. Oh my god. Whew. That is not a fun area. So now we get the final boss, which is like the final boss in the crystal playthrough to give you all the nice little gear for it, so you can just concentrate on killing him. And he's kind of a joke. Oh no, it's a giant dragon. Oh. Don't do it. I asked you not to do that. Nope. Now he spits fire. Oh, I did that wrong. I was supposed to be up there. Don't. Alright, so now 
you're gonna do, you're just gonna sit there, really. Duck. Duck. Party. Double jump. Party. Duck. Party. Move. Move again. Victory! Party! Lots of party. Yeah! Yeah! I did it! I did it! Oh! 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 So excited. Stupid. Stupid. Oh. And now you get the ending. Volgar the Viking. Warrior of Legends. Long ago you alone survived. So like I said, this is ending A. This is the best one. So... Survive the raging, raising of your homeland and force the raiders into retreat. Pursuing them, you slew them by the hundreds before they finally uh, wrecked you. All Father Odin, impressed by your bravery and might, shows us even for you a special minion. Slay Fafnir, uh, the greedy giant dragon, before his rising power threatened up all realms. You not only did you complete your task, you discovered Fafnir's accomplice, Nidhurg. I can't, I can't not say these Norse things without like the stupidest voice ever. I love it. Nidhurg. Without uh, hesitation, you sought him out at the roots of the world tree. Yggdrasil. I can't actually say the word, so. Yggdrasil. 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 There you go. Stupid. Uh, injuring and driving off. Nidhurg. You taught him a harsh lesson about interfering with the affairs of Midgard. Uh, not to mention granting Yggdrasil a free from his gnawing. Oh, that's cool. Don't really care. Odin did not deny your request. This would be mumbling just really good. Oh, hey, it automatically goes down. That's cool. 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 I'm actually going to call it here, though, because the... I'll watch the credits. It's just I can't actually have this part because um, it's copyrighted music, so I actually get a strike if I put it on YouTube. So with that, everyone, I uh, hope you enjoyed the Valkyrie run through. Um, like I said, give me a like, uh, follow, leave a comment, subscribe if you want, all that fun jazz. So thanks for watching.